Well, if you are a fan of music, you are going to absolutely love this upcoming GTA update. Rockstar are going all out in adding more music to the game. Today, they released two new news wires, and I'll be going over both of them to share all of the details that they announced. Now, actually, quickly before we get into the music-related newswire, they released their normal event newswire. This is the final event before this next DLC comes out, and honestly, it's to be expected. There's not really anything crazy. I mean, you get triple rewards on time trials and transform races. I mean, the time trials, that'll be kind of good if you're trying to make some some extra money just before the DLC. They don't pay a ton, but I think triple money is like 600 k for those time trials. So that's not bad, you know, if you do that for a week. But as for like everything else, there's not really a whole bunch. I mean, the Sterling GT is on the lucky wheel. The discounts aren't anything special. Although the only thing that's kind of interesting to me, at least, I can't remember the last time high-end apartments were on sale. Usually Rockstar put things on sale right before DLCs. If that DLC is going to have something that's better than what's on sale. I don't know. Maybe that means this upcoming DLC is going to have some new properties. Beachfront properties? Island properties? I don't know. It is interesting, though, how they uh, are all of a sudden putting high-end apartments on sale. But yeah, that's the event week. Like I said, nothing crazy. Just remember, don't spend a whole bunch of money this week. You're going to want it all for the heist coming on Tuesday. Now, the other newswire was the one about the new radio stations. You can see these are the five new radio stations. We have K-Alt 99.1 FM. Still Slipping, Worldwide FM, Flylow FM, and then the Music Locker Club actually has its own radio station as well. So reading what they say, the three new radio stations are Still Slipping, Los Santos, Cult FM, and the Music Locker. Uh, the other two, the Flylow FM and the Worldwide FM, obviously are already in the game. Those are just getting a little bit of an update. But reading through this, along the grand open of the Music Locker and its new slate of resident DJs, GTA Online's musical universe further expands to the launch of the Cayo Perico DLC, or the heist, with the addition of three new radio stations, as well as brand new mixes arriving to hit stations Fly Low FM and Worldwide FM for a whopping total of over 250 new tracks, making this the biggest ever musical update to GTA Online. Just a warning, this DLC is going to be a lot bigger file size wise compared to every other DLC. These music tracks usually take up a good amount of space and if there's over 250 of them, it it would not surprise me if this DLC reaches around like 20 gigs or so if not more. So like I mentioned, I think in yesterday's video or in the video I made a couple of days ago, get your 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 hard drives in order make sure there's space make sure your internet's gonna be good to go so you can download the update as quick as possible now the new updates or the new radio stations still slipping this one has uk dj joy orbison setting up shop in los santos with the hopes of launching his own pirate radio station they say it's out of mirror park which I wonder if we'd actually be able to go there. Might be interesting. Maybe a building converts to the radio station. But they say Joy the DJ here is ready to deliver a seamless mix of house, techno, drill and drum, and bass to the masses. The only problem is he's having trouble getting a strong enough signal to reach beyond his neighborhood. If he's going to take a sound or take his sound city and statewide, he's going to need some help getting started. Keep an eye out to help your local disc jockey on December 15th. So that's actually kind of cool. It's sort of letting us know there's going to be a little a little mission, a little side mission to get that going if you want to listen to it across the whole map. That's actually kind of cool. I almost would wish they'd do that to the radio station that's exclusive up this in Sandy Shores area. I, I like listening to that one, but you obviously don't get it down in Los Santos. But yeah, that is really cool. The next one, Cult FM. This one, tune in, turn on, and space out to the sounds of Cult FM, hosted by Julian Casablancas of The Strokes and Voids. The guest list is star-studded with appearance from Mac DeMarco, David Cross, and Tony Mack. 
and the station's playlist spans from the Madchester sounds of Joy Division, New Order, and a certain ratio to heavy throwbacks from Danzig, the Velvet Underground, and Iggy Pop, and everything in between, plus the world-exclusive premiere of the new track from The Voids called Alien Crime Lord. I'm going to be honest with you guys, don't know who any of these people are, but I mean, hey, new radio, it's cool. This one does not have to be helped out with. But then the final one we got is The Music Locker. Later this December, The Music Locker will debut its own radio station, bringing the sets and sounds of the hottest new club in Los Santos above ground and onto the airwaves. Featuring mixes from Kiai Music, along with genre-defined sets from Palms Tracks and The Moody Man, The Music Locker will be the go-to desk destination for house, disco, and techno. And then we have the updates to the older radio stations, Fly Low FM is a Grammy-nominated producer and Los Santos beat maker, Supreme, Flying Lotus is back with an all-new mix to rotation on Fly Low FM. Guest appearances from Tierra Wack, plus new tracks from Madlib, brand new material from Flylo himself, MF Doom, and a bunch of rare, exclusive, and amazing surprises. Again, I... Unfortunately for me, I, I can't have the radio on, so I don't really listen to this sort of stuff. But hey, if you're a radio guy, it's cool. And then the other one, Worldwide FM. Globally renowned DJ Gillies Peterson returns to add a new mix of new London jazz, disco, and world music for World FM. Featuring tracks from Kamasai Washington, whoever that guy is, Bad Bad Not Good, and MF Doom, plus many, many more. To keep the returning stations feeling fresh and to give everyone a chance to find some new favorites, Fly Low and Worldwide will be bumping all new mixes and tracks only for a period after the launch, with the classics being mixed in over time. So, that is everything we know about the music. Very exciting stuff. I know a lot of people love the different radio stations and love just chilling out, relaxing, and Listen to listening to the music. So getting over 250 new songs, three new radio stations, two updates to the older radio stations. That is just going to be great for us longtime players. Although I will say, Rockstar, I'm disappointed. Where's the synthwave radio station, man? They keep adding all this house and techno, and I like that. I like that genre. I want some synthwave. Imagine Night Ride FM. That would be great. But that is it with the video. Thank you guys for watching. That's the two news wires we got today. If there's any more information that comes out, I will let you guys know. Tonight is the game award. So maybe, maybe we see something from Rockstar then. That will for sure be interesting. And if anything does come from that, I will of course let you guys know. But that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Please drop the video like if you enjoy. Subscribe for more GTA content. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.